So why do we want to learn Latin? I would say there are four main reasons why you might want to learn Latin. The first is, I would say, if you want to know more about the classical world. So every day we come across all kinds of references to the classical world, and they can be really simple things like crossing the Rubicon, or maybe you hear a reference to Julius Caesar, or it could be many other things. You might hear the, the phrase quid pro quo and think like, what in the world does that mean? Well, this gives us insight into the ancient world. And if you want to know more about the Greco-Roman world, which has influenced our society in countless ways, just think of it this way. If you go to the store on Sunday and maybe you're looking to purchase something and you realize the store is closed, well, why is the store closed? Well, it's closed because of Latin. Because Constantine in the year 321 in Latin wrote down a law that said everything's going to be closed on Sundays. So you see that you have this window into the ancient world, and it really helps you make sense of the world today, that you can go back and see how these things of the past are able to influence us today. And in fact, they're going to continue to influence the world in many ways, and Latin's going to give that opportunity to go back and to study these influential people and the influential events that continue to impact our world today. Now, the second reason I would say it would be very helpful to study Latin is if you have interest in religion or theology or the Bible, there's so much of church history or the Bible or theology or things about religion that have been impacted by the Roman world and particularly by Latin. So, if you study Latin, it's going to give you this window into a whole new world that's going to really be very helpful to you. If you're studying theological terms and maybe you have opened up a textbook in theology, you'll see if you know Latin that a lot of the phrases as well as a lot of the thinking has impacted the way that these very textbooks and mindsets and worldviews have been shaped. And as you think about other areas of religious studies, and this is in, in countless different ways, that you see how Latin has played such a significant part in shaping this world around us. Here's the third reason why you might want to study Latin, because our language itself, the English language, it's not a Romance language, it's not like Spanish or Portuguese or Italian or French that comes directly from the Latin language, but it's one that's nonetheless been greatly impacted by Latin. And there are countless phrases and words and concepts that come from Latin. And so I know a lot of people who will come to me and say, hey, I want to learn Latin because I want it to help me on this test. I'm going to take a test. And it could be something, a test for college or some particular area, and they know that the roots or the etymologies, a lot of the words that we have, if they know Latin, they're going to be able to understand what's going on there. And as people have studied, for instance, the GRE, I had to take the GRE when I was applying to PhD programs. And one of the sections of the GRE is the verbal section which has a lot of really fancy words in it, and a lot of these words come from Latin. And because I had studied Latin before going into my PhD, I was able to make sense of things. And I have several kids, I have three kids, and they will come to me sometimes, and they know that I like Latin, and I always talk to them about Latin because it's just such a wonderful language. And they'll come to me and they'll say, Daddy, what does this word mean? And you know what? Most of the time, I'm able to tell them what the word means because I've studied Latin. And so I've found that Latin can be very helpful to learn if you want to be a better speaker of English, if you want to know word origins, if you want to be the most sophisticated and intellectual person at a party. Well, of course, you need to study Latin so that you'll be able to just pull out those word origins You'll be able to use very good language and vocabulary. If you have a profession where you need to speak publicly, 
your ability to know Latin and to see how Latin has impacted English is going to make you a better speaker because you're going to be able to use words that are more concise. And this is one of the great things about Latin is you're really not going to find a more concise or precise language anywhere. In the videos that we have and in the book that we have on Latin, I'll point this out a lot that we'll have a Latin phrase, and the Latin phrase might be four words. And when you translate it into English, it really clumsily translates into nine, 10, 11 words. So you see how precise Latin is. And what I found is when you study Latin and the conciseness and the preciseness of Latin, that it makes you more concise and more precise in your own words. So you're gonna be able to be more confident as an English speaker because you studied Latin. And here's the fourth reason why I would encourage you to study Latin, why you think, why should I study Latin? And this is the most important, because it's pretty darn enjoyable. It is so darn enjoyable to study Latin. But it's extremely enjoyable to read Latin, and if you learn how to speak Latin, also to speak Latin. So this is the reason that I really am interested in it. Yes, I do like classical civilization, and so that's the first reason it's gonna be very helpful for that. Yes, I also am very interested in theology, and it helps me a lot as I think about theology. Absolutely, that's the case. And yes, I like to have a larger vocabulary. I like to know that there are other words that are more concise and I can draw from those words when I'm having just a regular conversation. Absolutely. But this fourth reason is the one that, that comes from my heart to you. And that it's, it's just really enjoyable. And I found it's even life-giving to be able to read Latin. And I'll tell you this, and hopefully other people would agree, I'm a better person because I've studied Latin. And they, well, what do you mean by that? Well, I can go back in Latin and I've read some of the greatest minds in history. And they have some amazing things to say. And these are things that are not just interesting, but they're also edifying. And these are things that help me with my ethics. These are things that help me with problems that I face just in everyday life. And you have these really amazing thinkers who are giving you in a very concise way some things to think about and also some areas of your life that you want to improve upon or how you want to apply something to your life. And so you can go back into Latin and you can study these figures and it can be someone like a Cicero who wrote all of these letters and you can read through these and really learn what it means to be a human being. You can read through all of these theologians like a Thomas Aquinas or Augustine of Hippo and they talk about their faith and their relationship with God and Latin is a way that helps them understand who God is and that helps you as well. But in short, as you put all of these together, this is the one that's, that's dear to my heart and Latin is gonna make you a better person.